Anyways, yeah, join us Saturday. We'll be watching it and, and fucking around and shit. No sound, unfortunately, no sound. Um, but yeah, that'll happen or whatever. So everyone knows. But let's get into it, uh, you motherfuckers, because y'all yeah, left a lot of comments and ass. Uh, our social media is at Sunaman665 for the, the X. And at the Underground Broadcast uh, for the fucking uh, IG. Um, we're not doing the... We're, we're, the TikTok is there, but we're not uploading shit anymore. God damn it. Those motherfuckers. I don't want to keep go over it anymore, but it's still there. You know, it's, We're just not fucking with it anymore. All right? We don't fuck with that shit. Whatever you send me, we'll post here. Just like Gomer Kyle, he wanted me to send you a message to all y'all motherfuckers tonight. Gomer Kyle is not usually on in here. He's like one of the first that's on here. Uh, but he's not here tonight. Here he goes. A message for you all from the grave. No, nah, no, nah, I'm playing. <laughs> nah, he's fine. He's fine, everybody. But he sent me this message. He sent me this message. Here we go. Yo, fellas, I can't be there tonight for the show. We're going to Chattanooga. But I'll catch replays and uh, go woke pack and Trump 2024. Peace. Oh, yeah. Live. That's what I'm talking about. Gomer. Gomer fucking sent us a message and shit. That was badass, Gomer. You fucking guy. Um, and Joku sent me this uh, earlier. <laughs> fucking guy. Joku sent me this on IG. He says, Son of man, the underground broadcast. I'm bringing boobies, buds, and blunts. Let's stay blessed, bitches. Cheers. Mall flowers. Hashtag. Live. Shit, I'm gonna spill this crap. Let me move it a little bit further. Uh, hashtag THC. Hashtag marijuana. Hashtag roll up. Hashtag light up. Hashtag smoke up. Hashtag smoke weed every day. Ah, oh, yeah. Let me see. Let me see what you what you brought along here. Let me let me fucking slow this bitch down so we can all see. Okay, uh, he's got a bunch of uh, rolling papers, a bag full of weed from the hood with some pre rolls in there already, uh, and then something that says white run. C, cannabis flower weight three point three and a half grams, uh something, one point twenty five ounce. C A is that from Cali? Is that what that means? And they're like titties, and you open them up, and there's the, those the but hey, hey, that looks like blood from the hood. I think they ripped you off, man. Did you paid for the package? That's what's going on. Those titties. That's what you paid for, because that doesn't look that good, motherfucker. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Anyways. Uh, then it's like this thing that says Bob Dogs. Oh shit! Car, car caramel gelato, HC and TAC. That's some of the gummies that I took. I fucking feel amazing right now. I feel like I'm fucking floating in the sky. I'm not even playing. I'm like like a firecracker in the sky. I feel like that that Katy Perry song and shit. I'm a firework. Uh, baby, I'm a firework. I feel fucking amazing on these fucking gummy shits, man. They were like fruit roll-ups, and they taste like apple and ass. I hate the aftertaste. I had to go brush my teeth because I hate the way it tastes. But I'm going to tell you one thing. Fuck your seven grams. I would never, ever buy this because it's probably coming out of a dog's ass. That's they even put the picture right there, you fucking guy. God damn it. What did it look like? Did it look like shit? Because <laughs> it could smell like caramel, but that doesn't mean it's caramel. That's all I'm saying, fucking Joku. Uh, you got to be careful with that kind of shit. All right, look at the picture. There's a dog on it. <laughs> Anyways. He's got the blunts ready. He's already started smoking it. He doesn't care if it's dog ass. He doesn't care, folks. Uh, that's badass, Joku. You're that shit. I'm gonna play your fucking intro again, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I want to have the world, the world's most comfortable pair of ultra soft. <laughs> Cheers.
Cheers, Joku. Ah, the strain, Labrador. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, um... Thank you for sending me that, Joku. That was badass. Let's get into the comments this evening. We're going to start with our old friend, Colin Larson, 9656. This fucking guy and shit. He was asking, where you been, fool? And I, and I, and I told him. And, uh, and I don't know. He never replied. <laughs> Cheers, Kellen Larson, you fucking crazy guy from the army. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's see who else, who else left the comments. Oh, Anthony Windham. I remember this guy. 96665. This fucking guy. I missed the live show. I had to work. But I got some 120 milligram gummies to chill. And watch the fucking show. Oh. Then he watched the last, the last podcast. He watched it. He watched it. That's fucking badass. 120 milligrams. Look, I'm going to tell you one thing about the gummies. I don't know if I like him 100%. Uh, because it is a different fucking high, bros. It's crazy. And uh, I think it impairs more physically and shit. Like I was, I was trying to walk my dog, and I thought I think I almost tripped like four times. And I was like, "That's not good. I mean, that's never happened ever in my life. I have never tripped. Trust tried to walk. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh my god. So yeah, yeah. Gummies are definitely stay at home type of shit. Is all I'm gonna say." Oh, <laughs> that's why sitting on this chair is okay and shit. And I'm just feeling a trip right now. Oh, it's a whole different experience. Um, God damn it. Oh, well. Hey, cheers, Anthony Windham. Well, I'm glad you enjoy the show while you're tripping, bro. Cheers. That's, that's what I'm trying to do. Enjoy this trip. Try to do this every holidays, you know, for you guys, for you guys. David Latarte, this fucking Wong motherfucker. He says, by the way, as a bit of shameless self-promotion, I just made an anti-woke parody video of the Acolyte episode 5 at Dave under duress. Under your duress. Maybe it's funny. I don't know. I watched it. It's pretty funny, bro. Uh, it's like one of those, like, um, like he's just reviewing it, but he's like, you know, making fun of it and review bombing it and shit. Go over there and subscribe, you motherfuckers. It's fucking badass. I thought that. I don't even know if I subscribed to that. I, sh I should have. I don't know. I don't remember. I think we should. I think we did. I mean, it doesn't make any. I'm going to do it right now just because, you know, you put me on the spot, motherfucker. All right, fine. I'm going to search you right now and I'm going to subscribe to your channel, you fucking guy. I know I did. I watched it. I watched that son of a bitch. I was like, right there. I told you. I'm going to go watch it right now. And I watched it. You fucking guy. I was like, here it is, Dave, under duress. Subscribed right there. Underground broadcast. Just describe, subscribe to y'all, motherfuckers. You know, Son of Man did it. Remember, Son of Man does for 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 his his close comrades or whatever you want to call Americans. There you go, Americans. Yeah, 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 yeah. Patriots. That's the word. Patriots. God damn it. <laughs> Cheers. All right. Let's keep going. David Latarte, also on the Deadpool cameos revealed. He says, I can't wear sweatpants in public until I see this movie. I don't get it. I'm not. Somebody help me out with this. I can't wear sweatpants in public until I see this movie. I never wear sweatpants in public.
Peace out, Timmons. Take it easy. We'll miss you. We love you. On this channel. La tarte. You better be more specific to a motherfucker who's like high and drunk all the time. I don't understand stuff that's smart and shit. Alright, uh, cheers, La Tarte! Thank you for leaving comments, you motherfucker. If I ever get a bigger stream decks or whatever, you're gonna have an intro, you son of a bitch. <laughs> we love you! Oh, the Deadpool cameos revealed Marcelo Valenza? Shit! Oh, he says Electra Hearts. Uh, oh, wait, DJ New Kid is explaining uh, about the comment of Leve La Tarte's sweatpants. His boner? Sweatpants. Oh, because he's fucking, yeah, yeah, yeah. He needs to come. He needs to fucking see it. I get it now. All right, fine, y'all motherfuckers. I, I get it, I get it. You took away Marcelo Valenza's fucking shine, you motherfuckers. Here we go. Marcelo Valenza, well, forgive us for taking away your shine because your fucking avatar is fucking professionally, sh digitally sh fucking. It looks pimp as fuck. Yeah, 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 yeah. This guy must have some money to pay some motherfuckers and say, go over here and take some pictures of me and put them on my YouTube and shit. Make it look professional. Fuck yeah. That's what we need on this channel. None of these stupid ass drawings that look like a fucking two year old druid and shit. God damn it. Ah, uh, you wonder why there's only four motherfuckers watching us right now. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> Happy July 5th, everybody. Day after. Independence Day. The day Will Smith saved us from aliens. Don't you ever fucking forget it. That man used to be my hero. Then he did something stupid. In public. In front of everyone. Fucking dumbass. Hey, what the fuck happened here? Oh, I hate when this shit does this. Alright, here we are. Uh, next comment is none other than the fucking rapist, uh, woman, abuser, uh, no ma'am, this fucking guy. No ma'am. National Organization of Men Against Amazonian Masterhood. <laughs> On the Jonathan Majors Gets an Award uh, video, he says... What a load of ass! He goes on and cries while talking about a black man in the criminal justice system. Shut the fuck up! He didn't even serve any jail time for what he did. If he would have been treated the way a normal black person in the criminal justice system would have been treated, he would have been in jail right now. That's a really good point. <laughs> to your son of man. Hashtag. Uh, yeah, yeah, if you're going to point out that, yes, I'm, my, my nails are fucking bright, fucking neon, lime green, green. It doesn't match with the red, white, and blue and shit that's going on right now, but... It, you have any idea how expensive the fucking little things are? Alright, they're fucking like 10, 15 bucks. I ain't gonna go spend fucking a lot of money on different colors. Fuck you. Alright, you work with what you have. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> Cheers. No, ma'am, you dumbass. Uh, that made a lot of sense what you said, though. Uh, 
Anybody here in my neighborhood does what did would would have done what Jonathan Majors did, those motherfuckers would be in jail right now. But Jonathan Majors is getting like what fucking therapy. <laughs> Do you understand why it was wrong? <laughs> yes. Okay. Sign the paper. <laughs> All right, all right. Cheers, no, ma'am. Let's see who else. Oh, Anthony Timmons left us early. He says, on the Son of Man is excited for the Nosferatu in the trailer. This one actually looks good. I want to see it. I fucking want to see this. But I'm telling you, man, this... I mean, obviously, it's not a fucking, or I don't know if it is. It doesn't sound like a silent film. Maybe because it could be just the trailer. The trailer is making fucking, you know, the voices or whatever. But maybe it's a silent film, like the actual silent film. I'm going to piss me off. Or it's going to be in another language and some fucking bullshit foreign ass that you got to read letters and not going to piss me off too. And it better not be anything like that. Uh, aside from that, because I always think of bad stuff. Aside from that, this looks amazing. And I can't wait to see it. You motherfuckers. Cheers. I know about you guys. Anthony Timmons also says... On the Justin Timberlake was set up video. Holly Weird sucks balls. Literally. It does. We just, the videos are there, but the, the you know, so they haven't been released. Willingly. Not like the Kardashians. Oh, here you go. Everybody can see it. Everybody wants to see it. Let's make some money. Those bitches were thinking of. Anyways, oh, Gomer also left his two cents on the cinema and is excited for the Nosferatu movie. He says, Nosferatu is one of those first sad and horror ever. And the one who started all looks awesome. As a fan of horror and of the OG Universal movies and the Hammer films. Oh, MC Hammer. This I didn't know he made some movies. Um, with Christopher Lee, oh, from Back to the Future, bro, a doc, as Dracula, I've never seen Christopher Doc as Dracula, that's crazy, uh, and Peter Cushing, yeah, Peter Cushing's badass, as Van Helsing, damn good stuff, I just hack, I just hope hack, Bill Skarsgård doesn't mess this one up like he did in Pennywise in It, Chapter 2. And the new Crow movie I heard was an abomination and complete and utter trash. This year has been the first in a while. I'm actually looking forward to four movies. Cheers, mofos. Hashtag... <laughs> Hashtag I don't know what to do, Gomer, you motherfucker. I'm gonna think I'm gonna you know what? I'm gonna find an animation. It'll be a whole fucking thing. I'm gonna get some fucking I don't know. Some fucking fairies or some fucking unicorns. Something fly across the screen magical and shit. Freak you out. Oh shit, Anthony Wyndham just showed up! <laughs> Cheers, Wyndham! You did make it, motherfucker. I hope you didn't fucking murder anybody driving on the way home, you dumbass. You better have slowed down and looked both ways and not run any red lights getting home. <laughs> Cheers, window. I'm gonna give you the woke pack, motherfucker. Woke pack. 
Happy fucking uh, July the 5th, the day after. Everybody's already like, yeah, we fucking murdered all the British. Let's fuck all the women that are that didn't die. And that's that's and get drunk with them. And then the women were relieved and said, yeah, we'll fuck the winners. We're going to fuck those guys if they won anyways. <laughs> this is the day after, motherfuckers. All right, all right, let's keep going. It got crazy there. You see what happens when you show up, Wyndham? A bunch of nonsense. God damn it. Oh, well, oh, well. Let's keep it going, y'all motherfuckers. Oh, Rocco, oh, fuck my life. Let me hit it for this asshole. Oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby. Rocco. Rocco on the podcast video says, Damn. Shifty shell shock past. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, from Crazy Town. Probably was an overdose. Yeah. <laughs> I shouldn't be doing that voice for that. Um, son, did you know this dude was childhood friends with Punky Brewster? What? Soleil Moon Frey or Fry? Suleiman Fry, are you fucking kidding me? He even dated her a few years back. What the shit? I am too high for this right now. Are you fucking playing with me? Come to think of it, they broke up last year. Oh my god. This is recent. <laughs> that chick is hot. <laughs> No shit! God damn it. That guy looked like a junkie for uh, the last 10 years. The fuck is this hottie, hottie going out with this asshole? Oh my god. Cheers, son of man. Hashtag. Live. Oh my god. Alright, alright, you know what? Just... <sighs> Oh my god, Punky Brewster, bro. Soleil Moon Frey. Frey? 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 Whatever. Ah, uh, with Sabrina the Teenage Witch. I remember. Ah, uh, Melissa Joan Hart. Oh my god, cheers to the fucking... To our wonder years. Oh yeah! Yeah, cheers to you, Rocco. You're racist. Fucking Satanist. Yeah, you're not the racist. You're the Satanist. I forget. I forget. Anthony Timmons on the Son of Man really hates James Gunn video. He says, I don't blame you. I'm not a James Gunn fan either. <laughs> yeah, Timmons. All right. Take it easy, Timmons. He also says, on the Mortal Kombat... Uh, two movie was screened. I got a lot of spoilers for the Mortal Kombat movie. Like, this was nothing compared to what we, we didn't say shit last week. We just said it was screened and some other ass. I got a lot of spoilers tonight for the Mortal Kombat 2 movie. I hope you're ready for that shit. He says, the first Mortal Kombat wasn't bad. Not really excited about 2, though. Uh, I'm mixed about the fucking first one because at the f at the same time we had not gotten a Mortal Kombat movie in a long fucking time and I just wanted to see one and and it wasn't bad the special effects and shit I th just the story could have been way better and I don't know why Cole Young isn't it but we'll talk about about this later because we're gonna talk about spoilers and, and some shit's good some shit's good about part two but we'll see we'll see what happens. Oh my god, Depot's this fucking crazy guy. I'm gonna hit the fucking DJ whore for this dick. <laughs> this guy says, Hi, my friend, and a little penguin crying. Oh, that's crazy. He says, Also, on the Son of Man Hates James Gunn. Where's Puff D in this video? He's Puff Daddy's not in this video. No, oh no, nobody wants to be near that son of a bitch. Definitely not James Gunn. 
a motherfucker. On the comments video, Depo says, let's start drinking tonight. That was a day ago, you motherfucker. This guy's just like drunk at home being like, oh, let me just fucking talk to this guy. Ah, Depo, cheers, you drunkard. <laughs> Some fucking guy, dude. All right, all right, right. Let's see what else he wrote. Let's see. Let's see what his drunk motherfucker wrote. Depots. Oh, Depots. Fuck you. Uh, he like on the spacey at his lowest. Kevin just like some tight ass. Yeah, okay. Of course he does. He didn't even want the ass. He just wants somebody to pull out his dick or suck on it or let me masturbate in front of you. Like he's just perverted like that. Uh, that's all he wants. He's, he doesn't care. He wants to just have an orgasm in some way. He doesn't have to actually penetrate you. He just wants to violate you in some sexual way. Anyways, Depost, I'm not going to play the whole video. Look at that from start to finish. Fuck you. <laughs> We're moving on. <laughs> I'm telling you, the motherfucker's drunk. He's trolling. He also says, I have five US dollars for a burger. Well, go out. Now, that's not enough. That's not enough. You fucked up. Not enough for one hamburger. Yeah. I'm letting you know right now. I don't think it is. Not in a big city. You're fucking up. At least nothing that's going to fill you up. Kevin Spacey reaches a new low. Kevin is just very woke. He's going to replace Joe Biden on the horse. He puts a goat. Ah. He's just like, I don't know. There, there are, there's a lot of people that, it, that are famous that are probably like him. This guy's just very sloppy about it and shit. And this, he's a murderer. They're using him as fucking a distraction or just a way to say, yeah, yeah, this is him. We got him. Yeah, right. Y'all, y'all are in on it too, you motherfuckers. And it's like the Epstein, the Epstein. Yeah, Epstein died in Ghislaine Maxwell. They went to jail. But what about everybody who was on the jets and used him and went to the islands and to the parties? Why are they not investigated? You know, uh, I wonder why. But whatever. Uh, Diddy's Empire is a uh, gone video a long time ago. Depost put the key to the free pussy because I put they're gonna take away the key to the city, and that was a key that Diddy had access to any door in the city. So he went around raping women and drugging, drugging and raping, raping women, putting their tea, and then coming in at night when they're passed out and raping them. Uh, and so they had to take away the city, the key to the city. So this guy's calling it the the, the key to the free pussy. <laughs> yeah, cheers, Depost. Crazy asshole. This is why we're never going to get fucking popular because the kind of content that is put out on this channel. Oh my god. Alright. J Hart W in the Mortal Kombat was screened video. It says, I hated the fact that they sidelined Scorpion in the last one. Oh my god. You're fucking talking some truth here, motherfucker. He was there for the beginning slash origin and the end fight. That's it. The whole movie revolved around this new Asian American made up character. Uh, the fucking um, Cole Young. Oh my God. I got pissed me off. I should have been. It should have been Johnny Cage since the first movie, which is what everyone said. Because, oh, you can't have a white male the, to be the lead in a movie. It has to be a woke. And so they can, they, none of the other characters are woke enough. Not the black character, not the woman, not the Asian guy. So they had to make a fucking Asian American, Puerto Rican. He's got a lot of a he mixes. You don't know what he is. Fuck you. They fucked up, man. They had all the characters there. They couldn't pick another one. They had to make a brand new character. Fuck you. That's what I say to that. Uh, he says, Oh, well, hopefully this one is better. I hope so. Carl Urban is kind of too old to be Johnny Cage, in my opinion. I, I thought so, too. But who knows? 
The guy's a good actor. I've only seen him in The Boys. I've never seen him in anything else, to be honest. Love him in The Boys. Yeah. Cheers, guys. Cheers, J Hard W. I didn't see the trailer. This shit's been done. I don't know what's taking so long. They're fucking up. Maybe this is fucking shitty. It is. It probably is really shitty. It's gonna go straight to digital. That's how you know it's shitty. We're not putting it in theaters. DJ New Kid motherfucking left uh, a comment and it's just laughing my ass off, y'all motherfucker. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, 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 no, yeah, not much, not much there, motherfucker. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh my God! The next comment is none other than Houston, Texas, very own Jose Trevino. Repite su nombre, por favor. Houston, Texas. Eh, soy americano, mexicano, señor. Para que usted se cuadre, ¿ok? <laughs> Envidia, puto. <laughs> Fucking Joe T, man. The motherfucker's crazy. He says, What up, gay? I mean, you fucking... Is it fucking or fagging guy? I don't know. It could be either or. He might be saying fagging guy or he might be saying fucking guy. Anyways. I didn't care for the Spaceball sequel, but that David guy... And you sold me. <laughs> no, because when you think about it, you I don't want them to make one. But if they're going to parody Disney and make fun of Ray and everything, Kathleen Kennedy, everything, even the dorks, the fans, just parody the shit out of Disney and everything that's been happening in the movie, it'd be perfect. That's all I'm saying. Uh, he says, It would be awesome if they roast the hell out of Disney Star Wars. And by the way, that now now clip fit with your music. And yes, Mr. President Trumpet, sir. <laughs> He's talking to Trumpets now. Yes, we do have that Gollum bite him on the run. LOL. Hashtag. Whoa. Live. Sorry, hashtag whoa, whoa, pack. world order. My god, I'm so fucking. I'm feeling the effects of edibles right now to the max. Uh, but it's okay. One of these days, like I said, I'm gonna have a white, sober Mormon guy pressing all the buttons and shit on the other side. You won't even see. You won't even know he's here. He's pressing all the buttons while I'm just doing this. Oh, uh, yeah. Cheers, Jose Trevino, you motherfucker. Leaving your bullshit comment about Disney Star Wars. Now, now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Talking to Trump and say, don't be encouraging that crazy fucking guy. Every time he comes on his channel, it makes me nervous. <laughs> it sounds just like him, that AI. Oh, my God. Anyways, let's keep going, man. Y'all are crazy. Um, Anthony Timmons again on the YouTube is sabotaging my channel. And they are. If you watch the channel, you know exactly what you're talking about. Y'all tell me if it's letting you press the like button or not. Timmons says, I did see... One time that the thumbs up button was missing and when you did a live broadcast I had to go looking for it because it didn't get a notification even though I'm subbed with the notification bell checked that happens to a lot of motherfuckers. Don't let them cut your legs out from under you. They do it all the time. I don't know how to fight it. Keep fighting the good fight son. Well I mean that's all I can do. You need to pay them. That's what they want. They want money. Once you start going, giving them money, then they're all like, all right, we'll, we'll promote this guy. We'll put him up there and shit. Well, fuck you. We don't have money right now. Don't worry. One of these days. 
my, if my cousin comes back from Japan with his billion dollars and shit, he'll give us a million or two. We'll get it going and shit. Don't worry. This, we'll, we'll, we'll get this started up one way or another. The woke pack. We'll all stick together. Cheers. And it's always gonna be. Live. Wait, don't forget that. W. P. For live. Bitches. You know how we do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bring back the same uh, Garo from 90s. No CGI is the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. <laughs> cheers, motherfuckers. And cheers to you, Tim, and living comments and shit. Were you the last one? Is Was he the last one? Let's see. Yeah, yeah, he's the last one. All right, thank you, Timmons and shit. Again, whenever you send me to my fucking uh, social medias, I'll show and shit like in the beginning to everybody. Let's go, Gomer's uh, message to everybody. We appreciate you, Gomer. Have a safe trip, Chattanooga. I think that's where he said he was going. Some shit like that over there in the in the mountains. The hilly billies smoking the weed. Oh, yeah, y'all motherfuckers. I need to go over there and chill with that motherfucker in the mountains and shit. Catching them coons. Oh, yeah, the raccoons, the animals. All right, we're not being racist, y'all motherfuckers. We're talking about the animals. God damn it. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? Hey, if you like this kind of content, how about giving this a like and a subscribe? And if you want to watch the full show, click on the link on the right or check the description.